<laughs> it's bullshit. <laughs> What's up? How's it going, guys? Good to see you. So many friends in here. Hello, everybody. How are you? It's good to see you. Nice job getting first, Pookie. Thank you for being here before I even started. Will and Jeff Hack. It's good to see you both. Um, who else? KRV, hi. How are you, Kat? Thanks for uh, saying my starting soon screen was so cute. I appreciate you. Um, that's really, really kind. Uh, I work hard on all this shit, so it's thank you. I really appreciate that. Um, Bree, hi. Paul, hi. Deramis, hi. Mello, hi. You're adorable too, Mello, just so you know. Uh, did I miss anybody? Plum, hi, how are you? It's good to see you. Um, I am friendly. Care of you are friendly. Uh, have you tried not leaving them on? They turn themselves off when I turn the Wii U off. But thank you. I have, um, some AA Panasonic 2022 batteries on deck. Oz, what's up? Good to see you. And hi, Leaf. It's shower time, so I'll be back later. Hey, take your time. Enjoy your shower. Hashtag ad Panasonic sponsor me. <laughs> Truly. <laughs> Did you try hitting it? I, you know, we went like the entire last stream with it pinging at me that my batteries were dead. So we're not going to do that this time because I don't hate everyone here. Those are gone now. Hi, Clutch. How are you? I got rechargeables for all my console needs and never looked back. I used to have rechargeables for my Wii, but then... The rechargeable batteries died and then I gave up. Thanks for shouting out Clutch! Hi 90, how are you? It's good to see you. Um, I'm doing great. Thank you everybody for asking. I am doing quite solid. I got nine and a half hours of sleep last night. So I'm feeling quite, quite well. I slept forever. I laid down and I was out. It was amazing. Those lights are adorable too. Wowie, oh, thank you. Thank you. It's cozy in here. I stream in a cave. It's super dark in here, but it makes the lighting look really nice on camera. Clutch, how's your day going? How's everybody's day going? I hope it's been easy and good. I know it's Tuesday. Tuesday suck. They are the worst day of the week. The week. They are just the worst to me. I think Tuesdays are the least important day of the week. I think we should just erase it and go Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and just get rid of Tuesdays. So then I stream on them to make them feel a little less shitty. Uh, that helps for me. <laughs> Tuesday in it. Tuesdays suck. Bad batteries get the poke. Yeah, oh yeah, I threw them. Those bitches are on the floor. It's my usual off day. Oh, okay, then it's fine for you. We'll keep it. We'll keep it for 90 because I don't want to ditch anyone's day off. I just hate Tuesdays because it's like... It's basically Monday but worse because you don't have as much energy as you did on Monday from like resting on the weekend. It's just worse. <gasps> Your car broke down again, Clutch, no! I know that feeling, I'm so sorry. What happened, do you know? It just wouldn't turn on, or what's happening? I'm so sorry. I fucking hate that, fuck Tuesday, I agree. And fuck car problems. Oh, that's so frustrating. I feel that. You heard of a man cave? Fish streams from a gamer bowl. Get it? Fishy bowl? I'll show myself out. It is kind of a bowl in here. It's very small in here, but and it's cluttered, but I hide the clutter with my head. <laughs> Your engine overheats immediately. It's leaking coolant. Ooh! Call me tomorrow. Are you taking it in? I, my car did this, and it was like a 50 cent fix. Literally 50 cents. Call me at tomorrow, and I'll talk to you about it. It's hard to explain, but I'm going to tell you what it was for me, what it happened to me. Because that shit happened to me, and I took it to, hi Scarlet, and I took it to a, like, oil change place, and they did it for me, like, easy. I don't know if it's the same thing for you, but it's worth looking. Um, I got Final Fantasy 7 through 9 on the Switch. Yo, nice, were they on sale? I'm not going to tell her to crack an egg in the radiator, Will. It was a little clamp. There's a little clamp that holds the radiator hose onto the radiator. And that fell off. The clamp rusted off for me. So they just had to replace that and put it back on. It's not that, sadly. Fuck. Okay, well, I was trying to hope for you that that might have been it. Silva, hi, what's up? Saying hi real quick, I'm at work, but NASA called me because you're out of this world, dude. Silva, thank you. I hope you have a good rest of your day at work. Thanks for being here. Um, how am I just finding out you're a fellow Sunflower State kid? Hell. Yes. Okay. So I am from Ohio. I'm not from Kansas. Is the Sunflower State, is that Kansas? Hold on. 
Hold on. Hold on. Sunflower State. Hold on. Yeah, that's Kansas. Okay, so I'm not from Kansas. I am from the Midwest. I am from the Midwest. I'm from Ohio, though. So, uh, similar. Very close. Very, like, forgotten about state. I'm from Ohio, but I live in Florida now. So, very close. I'm not a Kansas girl, but I may as well be because Ohio and Kansas are, like, <laughs> right there. <laughs> because there's nothing there. <laughs> I have a rumor that you're from Canada. I am an honorary Canadian. I've been accepted into Canada's culture by way of Twitch. I have been welcomed. I have an actual Canadian ID. Not really, but it's real. It's, I, I'm part of Canada now. They're all roughly half off. Okay, maybe I need to buy some. Shit. I have a car guy at work that look at it and told me I need, I need to take it in. Fuck. Clutch, I'm sorry. That's the worst. I know the feeling. Me and my car have been fighting since three years ago. Hang in there. I know it fucking sucks. If you need to call and rant about it at any time, I'm here. Kansas Fish is a Judy. What is a Judy? What does this mean? What does this mean? I saw Sunshine State in your bio and autocorrect just Sunflower. Oh no, it's okay. That's like honestly understandable. They're very, maybe they're sister states. Florida and Kansas have more in common than we think. <laughs> Florida, I'm sorry. What's wrong with Florida? Jetpack, you don't like Florida? Judy Garland is Dorothy and Blizzard of Oz. That's true. What does that have to do with Florida? Oh, Kansas? We're not in Kansas anymore, Toto. I think you got it. Understood. That was... Oh, Judy. Friend of Judy. Old slang for an ally of the gays. Okay, we both went two different ways with that clutch with Wizard of Oz. I didn't know that. I've never heard it before, Paul. Thank you for teaching me about it. Loved your Twitter update. I was literally rinsing some rice before cooking and thought of you and your post. <laughs> Liar, I had to do it. I had to do it. I'm going to catch some shit for it, but I'm, I had to do it. It's good to see you, Liar. How are you? Alaska's just frozen Florida. Oh, 100%. The people there, I feel like the same people, the same type of people who live in Florida live in Alaska 100%. I saw your Spotify check, by the way, Will. I did see it. Oh, Scarlet, are you still here, by the way? Oh, shit. You know what I was listening to? I was listening to motherfucking Chevelle again. I'm so sorry. I know you guys lit me up last time I was listening to Chevelle, but I'm not planning on stopping anytime soon, so here's the link if you'd also like to be a degenerate with me. Oh, Nad, what's up? How are you? I was wrong, my bad. No, it's okay, Clutch. Um, I'll be lurking here and there because I'm still cooking. Enjoy dinner. Okay, Scarlet, um, I'm going to need you to look under under your chair into the channel point redeems. Um, there is a new one called, uh, wow, that's interesting. I'm going to need you to go ahead and click that. Just real, che real quick, cheeky little click. I was listening to Origami Angel and thought of you. Oh, well, that's so sweet. That's so sweet. I did this for you, Scarlet. It won't, it won't be in sound alerts anymore, but it'll be here for a while because I enhanced it. I enhanced it for us. I know Alaskans, trust me, they're both the same. Whoa! That's interesting, but I sure don't care. <laughs> we have the animation to go with it now. <laughs> I had to do it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Scarlett. Thank you and simultaneously, you're welcome. I fucking love it. I'm so glad. I found that GIF on Google Image Search and I was like, yup, that's gotta happen. That's gotta happen 100%. That's fine now. <laughs> uh, yeah, Florida, Florida people and Alaska people are in that same, just the same wavelength. Like, they like hunting, they like fishing, uh, they hate changing their minds. <laughs> <laughs> That's the most I'm going to say, but they're all pretty much uh, the same. So you know what? I could probably move to Alaska and be like comfortable other than the cold. The cold would suck. I would have a hard time with the cold. Are you a fellow frozen person? Yeah. Darius, are you in Alaska? Woo! Thanks for the woe. You aren't wrong yet, unfortunately. I wish I, wish I wasn't so familiar with it, but... Um, so other than car problems and hating Tuesdays, Chevelle, I know, Pookie, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I already said I apologize for being a degenerate. My music tastes have changed uh, over the years. Uh, when I was younger, I listened to a lot of like, uh, uh, like that kind of stuff. 
Like that was like my lane when I was growing up. Yeah, butt rock, dad rock, thank you. That's a really good word for it. Butt rock, dad rock, I don't know what else to call it. Like just <laughs> that. Hi Medikai, how are you? Good to see you. I'm a desert man with a lot less sand. Hey, wait, what does that mean? Desert with less sand. Is this a riddle? I'm a K-pop fan. I have no room to judge. Hey, I don't judge anyone for the music taste. Unless you're aspiring warlock, and then I do, because he listens to Kid Rock. But like, other than that, I I don't judge music taste. Listen to whatever you want. Just don't get mad if I'm like, I don't like this, because it's not whiny. You know? What about butts? We were talking about- Whoa! That's interesting, <laughs> but I sure don't care! <laughs> How's it going? Uh, we were talking about what genre Chevelle is, and Clutch said butt rock. Chevelle came out at the tail end of when I used to listen to Christian Rock. Their first album was on a Christian label. Oh, I actually didn't know that, Liar. I had no idea. Sorry, I'm multitasking. Don't want you to repeat yourself. Oh, no, no, Pookie, you're good. Not at all. Not at all at all. Not problem. What the heck am I even saying? Nothing wrong with K-pop. I like K-pop. I liked uh, Seven. S-E-7-E-N. Growing up, I really liked them a lot. Where are the Nickelback CDs? They're back there somewhere. I have the one with the car on the front, right back there. It is there somewhere. I'm not gonna look for it, but it's there. The context still confuses me. We were trying to figure out what a good genre would be for like all that like mainline rock, like Chevelle, Nickelback, like Kid Rock, Limp Biscuit. I think Butt Rock or Dad Rock. We came up with it because my Spotify check was Chevelle. <laughs> and I was ashamed. <laughs> I might not, be, it might not be your thing, but Lolo and Maggie Lindemann did a song together called Debbie Downer. It's amazing. I like Lolo, actually. I don't know if I know Maggie, though. I'll definitely look it up. That sounds great. Thank you. What about Creed? Oh, yeah, Creed. Obviously, Creed. Creed is butt rock, 100%. I thought you said, don't poop your pants. <laughs> I don't think I did. <laughs> Stu, what's up? What do you need NASA to call you for? Um... To tell me I'm out of this world. No, just because we're in space. I just thought it might be cute to have a little chat. <laughs> say a hero could save us. I'm not gonna stand here and wait. Stained? Fuck, I love Mud Shovel. Mud Shovel's such a good song. With arms wide open. I would listen. I still am sorry. Creed, Creed is, is just nostalgic. Not many have listened to their first album, but um, as soon as they recorded it, they basically got big enough for a real label. That's actually really cool. I didn't know that. I guess I was a bandwagoner. I did see them live once when I was younger, though. I don't really like the sound of K-pop, but I lived in Korea in 2009. Oh, no way! That's actually really cool. I'm trying to think of when I was listening to K-pop. It was probably a little bit before 2009 when I was, but that's so neat. <gasps> Thanks for the quiet hello. How are you, Sporky? It's good to see you. Album very much had a garage band sound. I dug it, but it had moved on to like the quirky white people music. <laughs> I never really looked back at it. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> I am more about producers, but since you asked. Oh, nice. I love Twice. Twice is good. Dervis, thanks for the quiet hello. Stained with solidly new metal IMO. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Maybe. I guess maybe I didn't really look into genreing when I was into that kind of stuff, so I don't know. I just assume everything I listened to was degenerate music because I got made fun of for it. I'm trying to get the army to send me adult space camp here in. Ooh. Is that a thing? Are they gonna send you to space? I didn't know there was this many genres. Holy shit. There's so many genres, it's horrible. Like, it's... I don't even try to jump into the genre the genre of game because it's like, people are just gonna tell you you're wrong no matter what. No matter what, it's just gonna happen. That's why I don't even try. I saw RV in concert in 2009. Micro oh my god, let's go! That's so cool. I really liked, uh... Whoa! Oh, John, hi, how are you? Good to see you. I really- what the fuck was that song? The- the- or the artist. Um, fuck, I can't think of her name, but she did the song Bubble Pop. And I really liked that song. 
Let's make pilk core a thing. Oh, 100% pilk core needs to be a thing. There's so many freaking genres, Scarlet. There really are. That's just ask what the band says they are. Band says they are? Yeah, right? Just be like, please just tell me what you call yourselves because I have no idea. John, how's your day going? It's good to see you. Hyuna, yeah, Hyuna. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I could not remember her name for the life of me. I really love Hyuna. She's really, she's really cool. Found out some Americans call a side of pop punk bubblegum pop. Oh, really? I guess I, you know, I don't call it that, Paul, but I'll use it if, if I think something's too poppy for me, sometimes I'll say it's bubblegummy. But that's like an insult coming from me, so I don't know. You know, I'll be like, mm, it's a little bubblegummy for me. But that's the only way I've heard it used, and I think I got it from my mom. I think my mom had said that growing up. <laughs> um, but I don't know. Mary, hi, how are you? Good to see you. Pilkcore. Oh, with the K. We don't even need the C. Just Pilkcore. It's beautiful. Parkour Pilkcore. Oh, there is the first album. Parkour Pilkcore. It's beautiful. Wonderful. I don't care about genres either, but my taste can be described as seven-year-old British nerd. I love that. I have no problems with that description whatsoever. I like some twice. I think Neon is my bias though. She's like a little chipmunk. I love that description so much. You mean after being an idiot at work, it's been good. You weren't an idiot at work. Everybody makes mistakes. Okay, I have to ask you guys, in a work setting, if you get an email about war games, do any of you know what that means? Would you be like, oh, I know exactly what we're talking about? Like if someone was like, hey, we're talking about, we're gonna, we're gonna start a thing like to increase our, our war games capabilities. Like, comp okay, yeah, John, competitive war gaming is what they said, yeah. Would you guys know what the fuck they were talking about? Cause I didn't, I wouldn't, John didn't. War games are something I've heard of. Okay, Sporky, I have never heard of the Disney movie. Thank you, liar. I wouldn't have known. Jetpack doesn't know. Nobody knows. See, John, you're not, you are not in the, in the, like, minority here. Nobody fucking knows what it is. Next in it's Prime. I don't even know what that means. Oh, is that a, is that a band? <laughs> I don't know them. <laughs> I work in defense and it might be something else. No, it's so I learned something today. War games is like a business term for like learning information about your competitors so that you can use it to benefit. To me, I was like penny wars, like for a fundraiser, like you put up jars and like for like, you know, different groups, you're like, oh, here's operations jar and here's, here's HR's jar and like, you put pennies in it so you can raise the most money. That's what I thought. And John thought they meant like Twitch streaming. None of us knew. We were, he, he was like, maybe they're talking about Call of Duty. Like we didn't know, nobody knew. Nobody knew what the heck we were talking about. See, John, you are absolutely not alone. I only know about it from Star Trek, but I think you guys have space. <laughs> I think you guys have space. <laughs> yeah, Mello, we, we don't talk about it often, but we have spaceships here. It's the war economy, nano, sh nano machines, son, the memes. <laughs> War game like World of Tanks? It's Paul, exactly. That's what we were thinking. That's exactly what we were thinking. They test things sometimes? Yeah, totally different. I was like, oh cool, I know the gaming space from Twitch and all, I can help. And the vice president was like, bruh, I hate that. That's such like a niche thing though. Like who the fuck would know that? The only war games I know is the movie. Hi Malibu, how are you? It's good to see you. Um, literally, I wouldn't have known either. Like I had no idea what that meant. So like, don't worry. Had no idea. For some reason, my little shout out thingy doesn't want to work anymore. Boo this. I'm gonna have to work on that. My little pop out thing. You never met someone who pronounces it niche? Yeah, I say niche. Niche, niche. <gasps> Scarlet, what sound do you want? Rip shout outs. I know, I don't know why I broke. Oh my gosh. What is this? Is this the one you sent me the other day? Yep, no one asked. Thank you, Scarlet. This is beautiful. <laughs> okay, hold on. Nobody asked for your opinion. Wee <laughs> oh my god, it's so funny. <laughs> It's so good. Okay, it's, it's there. <laughs> How do you find these fucking sounds, Scarlet? <laughs> 
I don't understand how you find them. They're so good. <laughs> My shot clips was broken last time I tried and I was like, okay, not JPEG. Yeah, it just keeps breaking. All of my webcam sources were broken when I turned on OBS today, too. I was like, all right, fuck you. I had to set them all back up. I was like, stupid. I saw it on TikTok. I knew I had to make it a sound. It's too good. It's so good. Say it your way, Fish. I say it your way. I think maybe it's a... Is it a science nerd thing? Like, science nerds are taught niche. And then, like, other fields say niche. Nobody asked for your opinion. We So good. <sighs> by the way, the Zelda 2 highlight legit is made better by the Yoshi and you mimicking it. I know, I, I actually was gonna, it's funny Jetpack that you say that, cause I was gonna start the clip like where, um, like on the successful attempt, but then I was like, no, this one's too funny. We gotta do this one too. <laughs> Thank you for watching it. <laughs> My webcam also borked on OBS. I wonder if it was due to an update or something. I feel like it it must be. I don't know. Because I loaded it up and everything's all fucked again. And I was like, god damn it. It's so good. It's so funny. <laughs> My Twitch is freezing up because I'm outside. But that's good. Oh, god. Sorry. Sorry it's freezing up. Hi, Dustin. What's up? Duchamp, thanks for the star, please. How's your day going, Duchamp? I hope you've had a good week. Um, we haven't played Mario Galaxy 2 in, like, two weeks. I remember when we stopped, I had to farm star bits, so we should probably like do that while we're talking. Because I feel like it's gonna take a minute to get- I think we need like 700 star bits or something to move on. I'm in the rabbit hole of browsing sounds now, there's so many good ones. But you have to upload like the best ones, I feel like. Is this too loud? How does it sound? I feel like it might be. The JoJo ones are sick, but they're a lot. Yeah, some of them are really loud. If I think they'll jump scare me, I tend to just make them cost bits. Like, you guys can add whatever you want, but if it's really loud, I'm probably gonna make it cost bits because I'm not gonna just let my anxiety fly all over the place because I got loud noises coming at me every three minutes. More like fart star bits, got them. <laughs> like, not farming, farting. <laughs> I'm farming! I'm not farting right now, okay? I promise. <laughs> if I did, I'd mute my mic, mic anyway. Like, I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna let, like, but not for free. Like, come on. <laughs> okay, so I think... Yeah, there was, like... Aren't you glad I napped earlier? I'm so glad you napped earlier because I miss having you around in my streams. It's like been too, you know, it's been too calm in here. I'm used to you giving me all kinds of fucking shit, so it's kind of nice having you here. If you're gonna fart on a stream, at least get paid for it. That's what I'm saying. Like, what, what, come on now. Like, that's not really my, uh, my lane to be in, but like, it's someone's lane to be in. <laughs> I need- I need to get some bits from somewhere. Where should we go? We could go back here, because there was a question mark one there. Yeah, maybe we should go here and see if we can get two birds with one stone. Holy smokes! Game starting 27 minutes in? Who are you? What have you done with Fiji? I know! I know, the only reason I'm doing it, Mello, is because I have to farm for a lot of star bits anyway, so I feel like... It's gonna take a minute for me to get anywhere. I need like a hundred star bits. I don't know how long that takes to get through, but it's gonna be at least a little bit. Where's my pointer? There it is. It's not her. She was too nice to me. <laughs> I miss having Will here. I feel like I can't be rude to Will because he doesn't get to be here that often. So if he's only here for like 20 minutes at a time, I feel like an asshole being like, hi Will, fuck you. And then he's like, alright, I gotta go. You know what I mean? It just feels like feels really mean. What would you pitch for a Stranger Things Season 5 and someone said Chernobyl is a cover-up for a portal and that's awesome? Wait, I can actually see them doing that though. I feel like that's not super far off for like what Stranger Things would do. Is that- are they- are they onto something? I feel like they might be. Uh, my last message was a test and the imposter failed. <laughs> I'm, uh, I got too much sleep last night, Will. I'm, I'm too nice right now. 
come back another day when I've had my normal uh, three hours worth of goblin rest. <laughs> okay, so how do I get star bits from enemies again? I think I need to like spin on them instead of jumping on them. Let's say. Yeah, there we go. Kick, kick, kick. That's how you do it. We're learning. We're remembering. Sleep is a lie made up by the suits and ties. Thank you. I agree 100%. I think uh, you have never been more correct in your entire life. I'm not being a total goblin. See, everyone's got the nice, the nice shit going on today. It's kind of weird. <laughs> that means chat's gonna be slow today because everyone's gonna be like, eh, I'll just watch quietly instead of being a shithead fish. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just be peaceful. I'll let her have a break this Tuesday. <laughs> I didn't actually move and start a new job, and this was all a ploy to get you to be nice to me as a prank on myself. <gasps> well, that would be actually psychotic. I would be really worried. <laughs> I'd be like, sir, why are you doing this to yourself? <laughs> I really wanted that to, like, give me something. I would be actually, um, afraid that I'd be like, Will has hella, hella abandonment issues. <laughs> like, <laughs> okay, what is this? Oh, shit. Nice. Let's go. Just came in to show you some love. Have a good stream. That dude, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Hope you have a great night. Thanks for coming in to say hey. I really appreciate it. You know what I must do? I must be the chaos today. Yo, Mello, light it up. I believe in you. I believe in you, cause the chaos. Oh shit. Is my mouse in the way of my sensor bar? Where's my sensor bar? There it is. There it is. This is this is a continual issue. Okay. Oh I think I need like 40 coins. 30 coins. I don't even have enough, sir. Hey, Fish, where did you get your, uh, nice outfit? The, uh, nice outfit store? <laughs> got him! I don't even know where I got this shirt, Mello. I really don't. Now that you're, now that you've said it, and I was trying to think of where I got it, I've had this shirt for so long that I'm like, shit, I don't know. Maybe, like, Route 21? Somewhere cheap, because I don't, I don't spend a lot of money on clothes. <laughs> I sent you a fucking 3D print of my head. I literally do have problems. Well, that's sweet. I thought that was sweet. I thought that was like a normal friend thing. This is why my expectations are too high. <laughs> I got all sad last night, so I got dressed up. Yes, it helped, but I didn't sleep till 5 a.m. Paul, so that means we have you for a while tonight, yes? Also, I saw your picture you took. You looked great. Sir, please don't come to my house again. <laughs> well, it's nice. Get wrecked. Wow, I feel... What do I even do with this information? Thank you. <laughs> I was gonna say fuck off, but that felt weird, so I was like, no, i I really need this motion sensor bar to react to you. Hey, Fish, did you get your gaming skills from the talent store, you great gamer? Uh, not today, because I can't get this bar to respond to me whatsoever. <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and say it's not my fault. <laughs> Sell the info on the black market. That my outfit is nice? Oh shit. Hi, Josue, how are you? Thanks for making me die. Uh, Chad has decided to be super nice to me today. Uh, I don't know why. It's been, it's been real though. You're doing great, Fish. Keep it up. Oh my god, what is happening? Oh shit. Why can't, why can't I do anything with this? Work for me here, sensor bar. Come on now. Work for me, baby. Can I move it closer to me? Would that help? Probably not. Better? Do I need to back up? Am I too close? I feel like we had this issue once before. Hello? Okay, that's better. Maybe. Doing my usual feast stream run. Don't lock the door. I'm not bringing keys. Yo, that's... Wait, is that just a human experience thing that we all say? <laughs> because I feel like anytime I'm leaving, that's the shit that I say. <laughs> A good run, Sporky. Thank you. I appreciate it. It's so weird how close work I went from I hate myself and everything. I look so good. Ain't nobody tell me shit. It's so true, Paul. It can do wonders for you. 
I'm glad that it helped. I really am. How does the great Chunky Yoshi in the sky favor you today? Oh, he's been favoring us. I'll say that. He's been quite quiet. But only you. Only you have the power to change this. Well, maybe everyone has the power to change it. But you are most likely to change it, I would say. Thanks for the whoa, Leaf. Welcome back. Always dinner. I really need a better strategy of getting these star bits because I'm not getting very many. Yeah. <gasps> Jetpack coming in with the whole one. We're holding him. Oh, maybe he'd help you. We're holding him hostage. He's not holding hostage. He's just. He's greedy now. Yeah, 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 Don't blame yeah, it. Don't blame yeah. it on me. Yeah. Hey. Oh. <laughs> Music's a little louder. Okay, thank you. Nope, I can turn it down. That's easy. Oh yeah. Is that better? Thank you. Jack, jetpack, beat me to it. Oh, I know he's so fast. Oh. Thank you guys for the oh woes. I'm Lim. <laughs> ah, oh, Our Lord yeah. is all giving. He cannot be greedy. <laughs> Damn it! The way I keep accidentally shooting the star bits I'm trying trying to collect. Oh my god! Hi, Hollow. What's up? Good to see you. How are you? This makes me laugh so hard. Literally, Will Will created that. So thank thank Will. It used to just be a sound, and then Will made that incredible animation to go with it. And it, it changed the whole entire game. It's the best thing. It's the best thing that ever happened. Truly. Everybody say thanks, Will. Thank you, Will. <laughs> You're doing alright? Yeah, Tuesdays are just like icky, aren't they? Um, you know, everyone's feeling quite high in spirits today, though, I think, so that's good. Everyone seems like they had a good Tuesday. I know sometimes people come in here and they're like, I've had a really bad Tuesday, but I feel like this has been a good one. So I'm happy that everyone's having a, a decent time today. <gasps> that was really scary. Will for mayor, that's what I'm saying. You're the best, Will. I agree. I'm doing well, enjoying uh, some, some, some fish, some... F oh. Are you eating fish? What did you make? What kind of fish did you make? I'm very curious. Okay, so we got some star bits in this adventure. Not very many, though. Simone, what's up? How are you? It's good to see you. Happy Tuesday. I have to create an altar for you. That's a normal human response. <laughs> Uh, baked salmon with a glaze. I didn't personally prep it. Hey, that still sounds amazing. That sounds so good, honestly. Salmon's my favorite fish to eat. I had to- I had to make sure I clarify that it's not my favorite fish in general. It's just my favorite fish to eat, you know? So, we could- I mean, if I can get 30 coins before we get to that little weird guy, maybe there's a way to do that. If you want an even better day, don't go on to stream or Twitter. Liter stream or Twitter can be a lot. I get it. I try to not dive too deep. Can we go salmon fishing? That'd be fun. Can, do I have to be... I don't have to... You can salmon fish in shallow riparian areas, right? Because I don't like being out at sea. My stomach doesn't like that. I'm the only marine biologist in the world that gets seasick. I can't fucking hang. Galaxy 2 seems like the equivalent of DLC for the first Galaxy game. Hi, Ryphon, what's up? It's actually really good. I've been really enjoying it. Hey, hey Luigi's here. What? Yeah. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> what just happened? You can be on the river shore? Okay, I thought so. I did not know we could be Luigi in this. Just finished doing metric ass ton of chores. Yo, nice job. Good for you. That's awesome, actually. I didn't do any any chores today. I just worked. I didn't do anything exciting. Um, but that's awesome. Good job doing chores. I'm jealous. 
Ocean boating and fuck off. Yeah, it makes me very ill. I've tried. Uh, you know, I don't get seasick often, and the only times I've gotten seasick were actually on the Great Lakes, so I shouldn't talk. But also, I just know it's eventually gonna happen, and I try to avoid it. Dan, what's up? How's it going? The hero we all needed. I know! Look at this. Look at this. Like, it, our experience just got so much better. How do I get coins over here? Like, how am I supposed to get as many coins as they want me to have? Like, they want me to have 30 coins by the time I get over there? Like, what the hell? A shitload of coins. I don't understand. Super Luigi Galaxy, right? That's what I'm saying. Like, that's the way to go. That was a lucky shot, Ish. That was a little risky. Maybe I just need to get, like, every coin that I see, and then we'll have 30 by the time we get to the weird guy. I'm doing okay, how are you? I'm doing good. It's been a very chill Tuesday so far. I worked today, um, but it wasn't a super busy work day, which was nice. I very much appreciated that. To not have a really stressful work day. Um, it was nice. Hopefully tomorrow follows suit. I need to go in the office tomorrow, but hopefully it won't be too bad. Uh, I just mean it's exact. it's- it's exactly- isn't exactly story heavy. Yeah, no, it's not. It's really- it's a great game, though. I'm really enjoying it. I've- I like it almost better than the first Galaxy, honestly. Um, and it's really pretty. Like, it's nice to play a game on stream that looks nice. Not that I don't play any games on stream that look nice. I'm just used to playing, like, pixel-heavy games. Um, so it's a nice change of pace. And I think, I know I've said this before, um, but it's really nice on Tuesdays, because Tuesdays are, like, my hardest days to, like, get up and going when, as, when it comes to streaming. It's nice to pick, like, an easy game that I know I'm good at, if that makes sense. Like, it's, it makes my life a lot less stressful. Oh, nice, I got 31. Makes my life a lot less stressful because sometimes when I'm like playing games that are really difficult, it's like on a t on a Tuesday I'm just like this ain't it, man. You know, I just need it to be easy. Cause I do I do like to play games that punish me, and I'm like, why do I do this to myself? Guys and gals, I need your help praying to Chunky Yoshi. Um, during my shiny Dialga hunt, I'm a hundred resets, and I know there's a lot ahead. You got this, Amlem Leaf. Good for you. Doing shiny hunts, especially resetting, that's... That's a lot. Um, good luck. How many is the average? Do you know? You give me flashbacks to Young Paul's first YouTube video, How to Be Luigi in Mario Brothers DS! Was it hard to unlock Luigi in the DS version? I can't remember. I can't remember if it was difficult to unlock him. We love easygoing days. Yeah, for real. Sometimes I think I, like, pick... I pick like really difficult games on stream because I know they'll be funny to watch and then I'm like, wait a second, am I stressing myself out? <laughs> Playing Zelda 2 on a Tuesday wasn't ideal, holla. Actually, I never once played Zelda 2 on a Tuesday <laughs> because if I did, I would have called it Zelda Tuesday, <laughs> but I didn't because I only played it on Thursdays when I knew I could have a drink. <laughs> it's a one out of 4,096 chance. Oh my God. I'm gonna say you're gonna get it on try 116. I'm calling it right now. Try 116 is it. I don't think I realized that, but it makes sense. Yeah, I just, you, you gotta be nice to yourself, man. <laughs> Tuesdays are hard, and Tuesdays are the days where I have to cancel the most, too. Just because life, life things happen on Tuesdays. It's a cute title, though. Right, I'll write that, write that down, write that down. <laughs> Why is this sign talking to me? It just says, don't fall in. I mean, I'm gonna try. Is this like instant death if I fall in? I feel like it is. Oh God, am I being chased? That ain't it. <laughs> Who is he? Oh, there's more! Oh, 
Oh god. Oh no! How did that even happen? Am I- am I just- what- oh. I have no idea what happened. I steal enough from you, you're good. You don't steal anything from me, what are you talking about? What if you stole something from me? Back from Lord Dao, had to outline some stuff for the Dragon Con? Yo, nice! When is Dragon Con again? That sounds so much fun. How's Galaxy treating you? Uh, other than just dying? Thank you for the rip, by the way, Jetpack. Um, it was- it's been fun. Very chill. I just remembered. Uh oh. I have nuggies in the fridge. Where from? Where did you get your nuggies from? Because I remember you saying last night you had some nuggies with, uh, with Fisher. I think these guys, like, hold me down in the ooze if they catch me. Which I am actually a really not big fan of. Kinda curse it, actually. I did it. I think we got it. Everything's fine. McDonald's? Okay, so how are you gonna reheat them? Do you put them in the toaster oven or do you put do you eat them cold? I have many questions. Because I've never had cold chicky nuggies before, but I believe that they wouldn't be so bad. But I'm also a goblin. So maybe don't take my word for it. September 1st or the 4th? Nice! That's gonna be so much fun. Is it in Atlanta again? I think it normally is, right? I'm sure it'll be a lot more enjoyable this year too, hopefully, if uh, COVID numbers are a little lower than they were last time. That'll be- that'll be a nice relief. Nice! McDonald's just doesn't reheat grain. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. It really doesn't. I mean, I guess you could probably do it in the air fryer or something and it might be okay. They're only- only McNuggets are okay cold, but this time it was an air fryer. Nice, good call. Yeah, putting them in the microwave is just asking for it. I got a bunch of Pop-Tarts from the store before coming back to Philly. Oh my gosh. Let's go. What kind of Pop-Tarts did you get? The best flavor of Pop-Tart to me, personally, is brown sugar cinnamon. Hey bro, I'm all over the place these days, exploring the universe. Next time you see me out there, talk to me and let me leap into action. Catch you later. That's so cute. Wii Sports announcer, noise. <laughs> nice! Nice cop. Sorry if you don't know what I'm talking about, I apologize. Here, now we gotta watch it just so nobody thinks I'm a weirdo. Because everybody's gonna be like, wow, why did Fish just say that to me? And I'll be like, I wasn't saying it to you, I was just saying it in general. Okay. I was just saying it to say it. No. Here you go. Nice car. There you go. That's what I was referring to. I wasn't I wasn't being rude or weird to anybody. That's that's what I was that's what I was referring to. Cat, thank you. Cat, thank you. <laughs> Clip it. No. <laughs> oh man, I'm sorry. No, it's okay. It's my fault. <laughs> Whoa. That's interesting, but I sure don't care. <laughs> Infinite fish, fish subject. You don't want infinite fish. No one wants infinite fish. It would be horrible. It would be horrible. Paul said, I've only tried strawberry pop tarts. I wanted to like them, but I thought it was gross. Yeah, the fruit pop tarts are kind of uh. Oh, you like the strawberry one second, 90? Nobody has all your opinion. Wee that one's really loud. I gotta turn it down. Hold on. Because I can see it's red. It's not loud on my end, but I can see it's red on y'all's end. So hold on. I gotta turn that one down. Scarlet, I love it, but it's very loud. I'm turning it down by halfway. It should be better now. <laughs> it's a great sound, though. That's the funny part. My mother-in-law thoughtfully got them for me. She said, I got you the lemon cream pie ones. Oh, my God. Because they're 100 less calories. Oh, my God. Stop this. You don't eat, you don't eat Pop-Tarts as a diet food. If you're eating Pop-Tarts, you just got to not look at the calories, you know? By all means, just the volume. I am. I ain't offended, thank you. 
I appreciate that. I was about to get up to see if anything's in the fridge, but I'm waiting for Blair Watch. Wait, was there a Blair Watch? Oh, well, nice. Thank you. Thank you. I'm glad you actually said that because I like did not see it. So thank you. <laughs> um, my, f I think I really like uh the pumpkin pie pop tarts, the brown sugar cinnamon, and the red velvet are probably like my top three. I don't really like fruit pop tarts that much. Pop tart seems so cool, but I feel like I have to be close to death to warrant eating one. Oh yeah, if you have diabetes, it would one hundred percent not be worth it. Nope, not worth it. Not worth the risk. Hi, Lydia. Hi, how's it going? Good to see you. How's your day? I hope you're having a good one. We're about to do a Blair Watch. So you're here just in time. My little one loves the pumpkin pie ones. I haven't had one, though. You gotta try one. They're so good. They actually remind me of, like, the McDonald's pumpkin pie things. Like, the, how they used to have the little apple pies. So good. Pop-Tart serving size. One pastry. Two in a pack. Deal with it. Yeah, who eats one Pop-Tart? No one's eating one Pop-Tart. Like, yes, I'm aware it's going to be, like, 600 calories evil. I do not care. I don't care. They're pretty mad, honestly. Yeah, they're, they're good, but, like, I think Clutch and I also grew up eating way too many of them. So that's probably part of our issue, where we're like, Jesus, get them away from me. Chocolate chip Pop-Tart. Okay, Malibu chocolate chip Pop-Tarts, I can't do. Because I ate way too many of them as a kid. The chocolate chip ones and the s'more ones... I don't think I can ever look at one ever again because we ate them so often as kids where I'm like, nope, I'm good. I am all set. No thank you. You know what Pop-Tarts are the biggest disappointment before we do this Blair Watch? Are the apple pie ones. They had a fall one and it says they're apple pie flavored. They taste like shit. They taste like caramel apple pops. Like you know those really sticky caramel apple pops? They taste like that but in Pop-Tart form. And they taste really, like, not real apple. I'm like, these could be so good. They could be so good. They sound like they'd be amazing, and they're fucking awful. You don't like brown sugar cinnamon, Malibu? What? I agree, cinnamon are the best. Caramel apple pops slap. The caramel apple pops are good, but not in Pop-Tart form. Just gotta believe me on this. I love the caramel apple pops, but in Pop-Tart form, they taste like ass. Cookies and cream pop tarts are solid. Ooh, I actually forgot about those. Those are the ones with like the cookie crust, right? They have like the Oreo cookie crust instead of like the regular graham cracker crust. Cause those are, those stuff. I haven't had one of those in a long time. Nathan and my spring break consisted, in, consisted of playing Dragon Ball Z games and eating Hot Pockets and pop tarts. I love that so much. That sounds so cozy. You shut your heretic mouth. Those suckers are a gift from the universe. That's what I just said, I like them. Calm down. I like- I really like the, the suckers. They're great. But they don't belong in Pop-Tart form, is what I'm saying. You're just gonna have to believe me here. Or you can go buy them and be like, wow, Fish was right, these taste like butthole. My favorite Pop-Tarts are chocolate cinnamon or s'mores. Which- the cho- like the chocolate chip ones, Miri? The ones that have like the swirl and the chocolate chips on them? Because I had those way too often. As a kid. Suckers are gross. You're gross. We're gonna go do a Blair Watch. Right now. We're gonna do it right now. It's gonna happen. <laughs> oh, oh, I, I see you. <laughs> Chat, looking cute today. Look at you go. Who asked you, Will? Roy, what's up? Welcome in. <laughs> Uh, I do like cookie ones too. Fuck, I just love baked goods. Me too. They're- oh my god, I just- you know, now I have a taste for Pop-Tarts. Roy, how's your day going? We're about to do- go do a Blair watch. Let's go find her. Uh, if one of the mods wouldn't mind typing exclamation mark Blair when we find her, that would be great. Is she right out here? No? Oh! <gasps> we found her. You're Stinky baby, you smell so bad. You smell like wet beef or old tuna sauce. You're a stinky baby, yeah. You're a stinky baby, yeah. I hear you. You smell so bad. You're a stinky baby, yeah. You're a stinky baby, yeah. She's so good. Thank you for thank you for the stinky baby song. Um, she's straight vibing over here, isn't she? She's just chilling. 
I'm just having a great time. Say thank you, Will, for the pets. I appreciate it. No treats today because I've had way too many treats today already. Wow, you look so sleepy. What do you do other than sleep? Hmm? Probably not much, huh? You just sleep all the time. Look at those cute little paws. Oh, where are we going? Where are we go. She's like, I'll prove to you that I do other things that aren't sleep. Where are we going? You want to give Chad a rub? No, that's fair. No, no problem. You can give the wall a rub instead. That's fine. Nobody's offended. Nobody's offended. They know you love you love them. It's okay. I get it. I get it. Wow, you're really you're really doing it to that wall, aren't you? We love that for you. Good job. Keep it up, kid. Yep, that's yours. You own it for sure. That is all yours. <laughs> Here you want you want your little wasabi packet? Claire. You want your wasabi packet? No? I'm just okay, this one now. That's fair. Oh. Doesn't smell so bad, huh? Say thanks, Will. Thank you so much for the player watch. I'm gonna boop. Boop. <laughs> you enjoy uh, marking the entire house uh, with your with your weird face. We love you very much. Um, have a great time. You're doing great. You don't get paid enough around here for the work that you do. Keeping our house smelling like a cat. Uh, I really appreciate it. That means a lot. Look, you can tell the spots on the wall that she marks because they're darker in color. See that? Oh, now we get a rub. There's a little dark piece on the wall right here where she rubs. You can see it. It's impressive. That's impressive, ma'am. You're doing a great job. Keep up the good work, kid. Yep, she nasty. She stinky baby. She stinky baby. You coming in with us? You can. Probably just gonna yell a whole lot, but you can come in with us. That's fine with me. Just don't play with the batteries on the floor, please. <laughs> okay, I'm back. <laughs> I'm just melting the purrs I know. She's good. I want to, like, pat the cat booty I know. The little cat booty paps. It's so satisfying. She loves that wall so much. Blair does deserve a raise. She's always working so hard. You have that bank, too? Do you really? It's so cute. I love it so much. <laughs> I love it so much. Hey, if you did the Blair command with your mobile lag, you did a great job. The way she walked up to you and changed directions last minute, the, the sass. I know, that's literally her entire personality. She's like, I love you, psych. Psych, just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> that's pretty much her whole personality. Hey, I said to not play with the batteries. Those aren't good for Kimptons, because if you bite it and explode a battery everywhere, we're going to have a bad time. Mickey, hi, how are you? Good to see you. What's up? I hope you're having a great day. Happy Tuesday. We're playing Mario Galaxy. How's your day going? My day's actually been pretty good for a Tuesday. Some days, Tuesdays can be shitty, but like, it's been good today. Thanks for the shout out for Minky. I appreciate it. The second one! <laughs> I love this game. Yeah, yeah, we're playing Mario Galaxy 2. Um, it has been solid so far. Quite solid so far. I've never played the second one. It's really cute. It's kind of hard to find now, unfortunately. Um, at least I had to get it on the Wii U. Because you can get it on the Wii, but it's like $100 to get a used game. It's like kind of outrageous. Oh, we've already been in here. So that's why I haven't done it yet, but we at least have it on the Wii U, like virtual console situation. Um, and it was only 20 bucks, so if you have access to a Wii U, it's actually pretty reasonable. And it's really cute. Oh god. We're going, we're going right into a Bowser. You'll love to see it. But yeah, we got the Wiimote busted out today. I do not have access to a U. Yeah, we use are really expensive. It's annoying. It's like you lose either way, right? Because you gotta either buy it on your Wii for like $100 or more. 
Or you have to buy it on the Wii U and pay like 300 bucks for a Wii U. You can borrow mine! Oh, that's me. Is that the Paint 3D Virtuoso Mickey Mist? It is. It is the Mickey Mist. Are you streaming from the Wii? That's the thing. I'm streaming from the Wii U. Yep. So we're playing on the chunky ass Wii U. I have streamed from my Wii before. I mean, I've streamed from my N64 before too. I have the necessary, um, like, adapters and stuff for it. It's really not too hard. As long as you have a capture card, it's not super hard. The adapter that I got on Amazon was like $12. Um, you could go bigger than that and have it be more reliable, but I've, I've had pretty good luck with it so far. So cool, yeah, so the Wii U actually uses an HDMI cord, um, so it's actually quite easy. Um, the Wii and N64 are harder because you have to do a uh, conversion from the AV, like the red, blue, yellow, to HDMI, and that can be a little bit of a pain, but it's not too bad. You just have to find an adapter that works with your capture card. Where the heck is my pointer? You honor us with your presence, Maestro Mickey, right? <laughs> I've been messing around with 3D art. I saw your post at Discord. It looks so good. Like, I am so impressed. Like, you're just like, you're like, oh, I'm just trying it, and it looks so good. You're so cool. You're cool, Paul. I could help you. A good adapter. I got my adapter, and it's a little uh pain in the ass sometimes. Yeah. So the one that I have, hi Brawler, what's up? The one that I have, uh, here, where is it? I can actually show it to you. <laughs> you know where I store it? I throw it on the floor. <laughs> no, I think it's over here. But I can show it to you. It's, it's actually in my little Animal Crossing bag over here, I think. Hold on. Yeah, this is what I've got. Uh, looks like this. I got it on Amazon for like $12. And you plug in your pronged device here and have an HDMI out and then you plug that in to your capture card. Danny, hi! How's it going? Fish, you and my cord situation is the same, I feel you. Literally, I'm just like, oh, I'm done with it. Boop! Floor. It's terrible. No! You're positive for COVID, Brawler! I'm sorry, that sucks. That sucks so bad. No issues yet? So I have had issues here and there. Dan, but I don't understand what's, what the issues are. So it works fantastic for 95% of the games that I've used. However, every so often it'll find a game where it just flickers and I don't know what it is. It did it for Sonic Adventure 2 in one level. It had a lot of water in the level. It was like, I don't like the water and it was just flickering. And Pokemon Stadium, Pokemon Stadium flickers, but only Pokemon Stadium 1, Pokemon Stadium 2 is fine. So I don't understand. I tried to do some Googling. People are like, sounds like your adapter's funky or like fucked up, but it works for every other game. So I don't understand. I don't really know. And it's not just on one system because Sonic Adventure 2 was on my Wii and Pokemon Stadium was on my N64. So I don't know. I don't get it. But for $12, it works pretty well. I can get you a link too, Dan. Uh, is it like a, like a weird lemon? I don't know because it works so well with everything else that like, I don't really get it. I also have a really like, I have like a, ch I don't know if I want to call it cheap. It was like $60, but I have a Chinese knockoff like capture card as well. Hi Kylo, how are you? Um, I don't use like an Elgato or anything like that. So like sometimes I feel like that could be it too. Get in there, Dan. We'd love to have you. If you're not in the Discord, y'all, please join. We have a great time in there. Of course. <clears throat> um, but yeah, it's it, it works. My capture card is just kind of like, sussy sometimes <laughs> i was close to buying an n64 but i was like I, I won't when i need one of those crt yeah yeah no an adapter works good i mean it's not gonna look like perfect like your capture is gonna be a little fuzzy it's not gonna look as nice as an emulator um but it works and it's cool to be able to show people like look i'm streaming from my n64 people are like wow good job <laughs> um i'm so sorry you're feeling shitty brawler i hope you feel better soon um get some rest um Keep drinking water. Uh, I hope you're feeling better ASAP. So sorry you tested positive. That shit sucks so bad. I have avoided it, knock on wood, so far. Um, but you know, it's only a matter of time, I feel, before we all get it, you know? Like, I feel like it's just a matter of time before everybody in the world gets it at some point. So, you know, I'm enjoying it while I can. Cause I know it's just, it's just a thing that's gonna get everyone. 
her the herd immunity thing is like it's just a fact of life sorry i keep having to move my sensor bar because like i keep putting things down in the way of it because of the way i am as a person <laughs> and then i lose i lose connectivity with it <laughs> oh. I got an RGB mod, special component cables, and a retro tank upscale, and it's still, you know, passable. That's what I'm saying, liar. Like, it's so, it's so shitty because you could really go those not like extra nine yards. Um, and I might eventually. Right now, I just don't really think it's worth it for my setup and how often I use my N64 on stream. Um, but you know, when I first bought my capture card too. Like, I didn't even know if I was going to stick with streaming. So, like, I just kept it really cheap, really simple. I paid $60 for my capture card and was like, you know, I don't want to spend, like, $250 on a capture card if I stream for, like, two months and then quit. Um, and honestly, like, this... <laughs> nice job doing the exact same thing, Peach. Um, this capture card has been the one that I've used since the very beginning. It has never let me down. So I got really lucky on the first try. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Nice, got it, understood. I finally got this uh, year after, no, last month you got it. No, I'm sorry, was it, I hope it was all right. I hope it wasn't too bad, Simone, because I know, I know some people have like, ah, oh, shit. People have like mixed reviews about like how, how bad it is, you know what I mean? Some people are like, oh yeah, it was no big deal. And other people are like, I literally never felt worse in my entire life. So it's hard, it's so hard to know like how your body's gonna handle it and how, like, hot your virus is, you know? I know you're not the only retro streamer on Twitch, but I was worried I was, like, stepping on your toes. Oh my god, Paul, what? No, not at all. I'm so happy to, like, help folks stream what they want to stream. I, I mean, I obviously can't help everything, can't help everyone with everything, but, like, I also love watching people stream retro games, so, like, trust me, if I can assist with helping homies play games that I like to watch, like, that is awesome for me. Hi, Maki Bear, what's up? Good to see you. No, I am not territorial on Twitch at all. Like, because I think, I don't know. I just, I just think that's too much energy to be territorial on Twitch. You know what I mean? Like, I have so many other things in my life going on that aren't Twitch that like, I can't imagine being like, I don't know, being like that. Being like, no, that's my thing. <laughs> Especially with a broad, as like as broad of a category as retro gaming. Like, that's just like such a huge thing on Twitch and I could never like claim that. Blair, shut up. Shut up! You wanna leave already? Hi, Mock, what's up? Good to see you. How's it going? Blair, you're making me get up all the time. Bye. Love you, bye. <laughs> I'm still happy with it though. Plus, similar upgrades, my Ness and SNES look amazing. Heck yeah, yeah. Eventually, I would love to get a setup like that. Like, once, once like I have a setup that's a little bit more permanent too, because Whoa. like- that's interesting, but I sure don't care. Because, like, for me, this setup, although it's permanent right now, once I move and, like, own a place of my own that I'm going to stay in, like, forever, um, I would like to have, like, a, a more robust setup where all of my consoles can, like, kind of live permanently rather than, like, the setup that I have right now with my laptop and stuff. So, you know, that's at least what I would like to have in the future. So that would be cool. Eventually. <laughs> ah, appropriate. <laughs> you like it? I added it. I couldn't resist. <laughs> Mock and Bear, how's your Tuesday? Mock, how's your Tuesday? I hope it's going well so far. Um, hopefully, hopefully no, no stress. How do I, I need to get, I need to, oh, let's see. Can I hit that for more there? Or do I just need to get it to follow me, maybe? Oh, I maybe wait over there and it'll cross? That's gotta be it. On this note, do you know where the best place to purchase one of them fancy Pro N64 controller stream thingies? Streamer friend wanted to stream Ocarina of Time, but they can't find any. I thought you might have a secret hookup. I wish I did, Mello. But they're so hard to get. I know John recently got his just by keeping a lookout 
on the Nintendo website because they like restock here and there, but they have not been restocking them very quickly at all. Like they've been taking their sweet old time with it. It's so annoying. Hi Siggy, how are you? It's good to see you. It has been a very annoying experience to get one of those N64 controllers. Like they restock them at a snail's pace. It's very frustrating. It was crazy hard, but it's worth it once you get your hands on one. Yeah, I agree. They're so neat. It's totally worth it. Um, especially for games like Ocarina of Time, because the button situation is, like, not friendly using Joy-Con. Like, it just doesn't make sense on Joy-Con. It feels so weird. It's been super 9 out of 10. Just got back from an ultimate game feeling fresh, healthy, submissive, and breedable. Let's fucking go, fucking bear. I need you to write my daily affirmations, truly. Not that I ever thought you were the one to be territorial, but, you know, never fitting in. Um... Never fitting, wanting to try things, but I worried I'd be- Oh my god, it's okay, Paul. I get it. I totally get it. Trust me. No judgment here. I'll just be excited that you're- I saw that you bought Final Fantasy VII, and I was like, Hello. I wanna watch. <laughs> Gosh dang it, thanks for the intel. I don't feel like I helped very much, but, um, it's totally worth it if you- I would, like, try and find a site that maybe will notify your friend when they restock. Took you two years to get the SNES controllers. I didn't even try for that one. Only the N64 one, but I know that was so similar. Yeah, and you can use it on your computer, which is so dope. I need to still uh, try to connect that. Whenever we play um, Donkey Kong 64, that's what I was planning on doing. Our old college town is getting kids back in it and feeling older by the second. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, Suni. How are you? I know. Literally, you're, it's like, it's weird to be like, damn, college kids make me feel old now. And you're like, fuck. You get to play the Live Alive remake with actual SNES controllers, which is amazing. That is so cool. Thank you for the shout out for SUNY Pookie. I appreciate it. If you guys don't follow SUNY, what the heck are you doing? What the heck are you doing? Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Um, oh, we're still on like hella slow mode. I didn't realize that. Let me put it on like less slow mode. There we go. That's better. You guys must have been really Gabby last stream. <laughs> College kids always made me feel old. Oh, really? I feel like I, I, I feel like I get along pretty well with college kids, but I think that's also because I am very young at heart, um, and I don't like to talk about stressful things. <laughs> so like for me personally, when people are like, let's talk about like drinking and games, I'm like, hell yeah. <laughs> Instead of talking about like stressful house things and stuff, and I'm like, ah. You're basically a Skella man now. No, you're not. You're not a Skella man. Tetsuya, what's up? Good to see you. How are you? Happy Tuesday. How was the rest of your stream, Suni? Are you uh, getting close to finishing Dream Practices? Don't you know when to quit? I'm gonna enjoy taking you out from the cozy confines of my robot cockpit. So, do you want a grand? You want a grand star, do you? Well, come on, tough guy. Let's see if you're any match for my Mega Hammer. So it's just video games, that's what I like. <laughs> that and seven-year-old British nerd music. Hey, nothing wrong with that, except I don't drink. Hey, that's totally fine. No judgment here. Let's talk about the stock market. Bop, never, don't want to. Not interesting to me, I can't do it. I'm old enough to comfortably have a child in college right now, so trust me, the feeling only gets worse, but you stop caring so much. Oh yeah, I, believe me, how many times I've heard from people, uh, are you and Josh getting married? When are you gonna have kids? What's happening? And I'm like, oh my God, stop asking me. Literally stop asking me. I wrote my first blog for this internship and this shit is so jank. <gasps> oh no, they didn't give you anything, like any resources or anything. Fuck, I'm sorry, Pookie. That's so rough. Plus folks say I look younger. Dan, I think it's all about the attitude sometimes. Cause I get that too, where people are like, oh, you act young. So I assume you're young. Um, but you also look really young too. So that, like, the combo does a lot. I'm doing well, Tatsuya. Uh, I actually have a lot of energy today because, like, I slept for a very reasonable amount of time yesterday instead of getting, like, six hours of goblin sleep. So that was nice. You're doing it till November. I hope maybe it gets better, you know? Maybe it'll get better and then it won't feel like as long. I hope. I'm excited to stream the OG Final Fantasy VII. Yeah, I'm so excited. Yeah, PS5 only is so lame. I can't believe they haven't come out with it on uh, PC yet. Three-fourths of it was chest hunting, but we did finish another world. Nice! Three worlds away. Hey, that's actually really good. Those games are long. They're crushing it. Literally stop asking. Yeah, I know. Pe like, people are so incessant with that kind of shit, Bakkenberry. It's so annoying. <laughs> they go away after a while. I hope they do, because I just don't want to. You got told you look 24, Miri. Let's fucking go. It's definitely the attitude for Fiji. Yeah, I look old as shit. <laughs> 
It's for you. Your portfolio is going to be hella sick when you finish. That's true. Your portfolio is going to look bomb. Please don't tell them. We won't tell them anything. It's probably BS for you, but like, it's honestly probably way better than most people could do. So good job. Um, I get a lot of, when are you going to date? Bring your girl around, Jetpack. Oh my God. I, all those questions are like, it's so personal. Like people need to just mind their own business. I don't understand that attitude. Like I could never walk up to a friend and be like, when are you gonna get married? When are you gonna start dating? Like, I don't know. It just seems so rude to me. I can't handle it. I'm like, I just don't. Is that boobies? Does this robot just have boobies? Are we fighting a, a mommy robot? Bowser Jr. is a punk. What's up, Quiet Mountain? How are you? I think we're fighting a, a booby robot. I think I need to. Oh god. My controller didn't aim. Okay, there we go. Come back, Yoshi. Come back. <laughs> okay, maybe we need to do this and then hit it from the back. That's what she said. <gasps> Thanks for shouting out Quiet Mountain! I appreciate it. People ask, are you... People ask, are you getting married and having kids when they hate their twins? Oh my god, Mary, such a good point. Yeah, I feel like people are like, why aren't you doing this like everyone else? And I'm like, I don't want to do it like everyone else. I'm just vibing right now. Yeah, I hope. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> it's, uh, it's, it's just, I just hate it when people ask shit like that. It's so frustrating. You're like, just stop. Stop asking. Tell them uterus don't work and start crying. That'll shut people up about kids, literally stuff. But I, I, I don't have that as an excuse. However, I, w I just wouldn't want to lie about that. I would feel bad about it. But also, hi, how are you? It's good to see you. I just, I just, I just avoid it. I just like, I totally avoid the question altogether. I'm just like, ha ha, and then like move on because I don't like conflict. <laughs> Do you have a boyfriend? Yeah. Oh my God. Please get the fuck out. Literally. You're like, please stop. Just stop. Is that a back booba then? I think it was a back booba. Wait, haven't we talked about back boobas before? <laughs> Amy and I went out to breakfast for at a diner. She used to work out and her friend went up to her while I sat down. She looked at Amy and said, oh my gosh, do I see a bump? <gasps> what the fuck? That's so fucking... Oh my god, that's so uncomfortable. What the fuck? That's like textbook, don't do that to people. Like, that's so fucking horrible. Yeah, Steph, that's fair. I just don't- I just- I can't- I, there's something in me that I just can't do it. My people pleaser comes out too much. I can't do it. I can't do it! I wish I could, though. Kind of not thing lie about. Yeah. Um, it's good to go out of your comfort zone, for sure, Pookie. Um, and I bet you're doing a killer job at it. I bet you are. It feels weird because you start, like, with training wheels, but once you get used to it, it's actually super liberating. Mello, let's go. Um, fortunately, my sister has a couple of kids, so my mom gets to be a grandma. Oh, so they've kind of let off from you. That's, like, way better. Yeah, having kids to be around that aren't yours is, like, way easier. I would be livid, too, Josue. That's really fucked up. That's such, like, a... Like, that's such an obvious thing to not do as well. It's like, come on, man. Like, you... You should know this. Like, it blows my mind that people don't use their brain when it comes to shit like that. Like, what are you thinking? You know, like, what? what is someone thinking when, when they decide to say shit like that? I just don't get it. It blows my mind. I will never understand. Meanwhile, I feel guilty about, like, I'm like, was my tone of voice wrong when I talked to this person earlier? <laughs> like, my god. People can be so rude. Did I do it? Do I need to hit them again? Seems that way. <gasps> shit. Shit, shit, shit. I think it's just the lead poisoning, literally. <laughs> I have, uh, I have seen that theory. <laughs> and I love it so much. The reason why that certain generations have zero attack is because of the lead in the water. <laughs> Oh my god, it kills me. 
Give coin. Oh my god. Now Yoshi's dead. Everything's bad. Everything's bad. Give Yosh. There's so much happening right now. I'm at that point where I answer none of your damn business. Yeah, honestly, try being disabled. Yeah, come back to me and ask questions. Literally, Jetpack. Totally. It's so rude of people to even ask questions in general. This way, Amy is a saint to have laughed that off because that is that probably really hurt. I imagine that was not fun for her to hear. I was at Costco and forgot ice cream. Yo, I got ice cream the other day and I got, what did I get? I got one that was like chocolate cookie crumble and I got one that was uh, like banana peanut butter and I'm so excited. haagen was buy one, get one and I was tickled. I was absolutely tickled. Um, my parents kind of know I'm gay. Well, last time we had that talk, I said I was bi because I thought I was. My sister and her kid had her kid. I made a point to say in front of everyone, I'm glad you're continuing um, this bloodline. I'm sure as hell not gonna. Hey, it's good to prep them early. You know what I mean? Like, you gotta, you gotta, like, make sure, like, it's your life, you know? It's your life. And you gotta, you gotta, like, tell people your real feelings. Not Yoshi. I know this sensor bar is actually killing me. Not to blame it on the controller, but it is actually like not reading at all. <laughs> Snip trip 2022. Yep. Snip trip. Totally. <laughs> it's the way to go. <laughs> Hi, Gail. What's up? How are you? How's your day? We are fighting with a sensor bar right now, but we're doing it. Happy Tuesday. I hope you're having a great day so far. What's Fishy's favorite ice cream? I am like a basic like chocolate or peanut butter person. I really like espresso ice cream as well. Like any coffee flavors are really up my alley. Um, but I typically go for like chocolate or coffee stuff. I don't really care for mint. Like that's really the only flavor that I'm like hard pass on. I'm really not big on mint. Um, but I don't judge people who do like mint. Coffee ice cream is so good, I know. And it's like, it's great because like, coffee ice cream is one of those things where like, you can have it and it's just as good as having a cup of coffee, I feel like, other than all the caffeine. So like, I can have it late at night and I don't like have to feel bad. I haven't had ice cream in so long, wait, why not? Get yourself some ice cream, it's like so hot out. It's the best time to get ice cream. Why not? Go get yourself some right now, I demand it. This is, this is, this has to happen. Oh my gosh. Yoshi? You're killing me. Oops. Sorry, Yoshi. Okay, here we go. We're going. We're going to the other side where things are better and more peaceful. And we'll wait it out for a second. This will be better. Perfect, beautiful, wonderful. I love ice cream. Literally, I'm probably gonna finish the little thing of Hagen Dust that I have after the stream. I think I think that's just gonna have to happen. I just forget it exists. Hey, as long as you're not like craving it and resisting, because that don't do that to yourself. Have all the ice cream you want. You deserve it. Well, go get ice cream right now. Do it. Do it. You can eat. and yes, I I agree wholeheartedly about like not I just saw you say you can return your niece after a while it's like such a game changer not having to like deal with the responsibilities of having having children all night <laughs> I know that probably sound makes me sound so like greedy with my time but I just don't think I could do it I don't think I have the energy for it I think I am just I am just not I'm not cut out for it if I can't like be as enthusiastic about having a child as I am as enthusiastic about having a dog, I don't think I don't think I'm cut out for it. You know? It's just not for me. Fuck off, I'm allergic to children. I can't. I'm waiting for the son of God to manifest in my womb. <laughs> Storks are on strike. Fuck off, please. Scheduling issues when having money stops being awesome. Waiting for a sale on Amazon. <laughs> I'm busy raising my inner child. Did you come up with all of these yourself? 
because this is an amazing quote. That girl, I never resist a sweet treat. Good, good. You shouldn't because you deserve them. Thank you, Bachenberry, for this amazing quote. That's amazing. <laughs> 10 out of 10. I am greedy with my time, not apologetically. Literally, I am. That's like, I feel like I'm a pretty generous person when it comes to most things, but like, I just, I am selfish with my time. I will be selfish with how I spend my time. I didn't, I didn't, yeah, literally, Paul, I didn't care for kids until my sister had hers, and I can, can return my niece, precisely. It's like you get the taste, but not the actual caffeine. Yes, exactly. Uh, Suni, uh, you can have ice cream for dinner if you want. That's the best part about being an adult. <laughs> I did blow out its back, Mock. We did it. We, we succeeded. Those reasons are incredibly good. Incredibly good. Imagine I die right here trying to get the star. Tears for years. Nice. We're adults, we are! You can eat anything you like! Exactly! It's great, it's fantastic. Have ice cream for dinner. I'm not gonna tell you not to. Do your thing. Back with some ice cream. Hell yes, Yumi. Enjoy your dinner of ice cream, I hope. Which ice creams are actually good? Like pistachio, maybe? Something like high in protein? I don't know. Peanut butter ice cream? Uh, we have the bodies of adults with the minds of kids, so true. <laughs> That's definitely how I feel. <laughs> I can get Trader Joe's ice cream. I don't know if I've ever had Trader Joe's ice cream, Will. Is it, like, way better? I usually go with, like, Publix brand or haagen -Dazs. Personally. Um, but I'm not really that picky. I'll have pretty much anything. I look forward to having kids, but I'm in no rush and could not really be bothered with what other people do. Yeah, agreed, and that's how it should be. Though if anyone has kids, I will smother them with so much affection, make a play for the title of Uncle Josue. That's very sweet. I, I like hanging out with people's kids. It's just I've never, I've never had like a passion to really have my own. So, and I don't think there's anything wrong with either option. You know, let people do what they want to do. I can't eat anything. I like metabolism is slowing down. Same. If I have ice cream, I gotta like go to the gym the next day, or else I feel like shit. <laughs> <laughs> because I feel like I look at something and I like gain weight from it. It's so lame. I hate it so much. That's like new within the last couple of years too. It's like, damn it. Well, it's also probably because I've been streaming too, where like I spend more time like sitting and working from home now. So like that probably is additive to like aging as well. Calcium, ample protein, low poly unsaturates. I mean, it's pretty good on paper. Mellow, thank you. Thank you for this. Can you make beer look good on paper now? I did see the Choco Taco is dead, Mock. I couldn't believe that. I was like, what the fuck? Who's- who did this? Whose choice was it? Are they just doing this so they can bring it back and make a big deal out of it? I bet they are. I bet that's the whole thing. Which sucks. Pistachio ice cream is so good. Ooh, Trader Joe's horchata ice cream. That sounds so amazing. I just do a nice vanilla and add my own pistachios. Maple syrup on ice cream? Oh my god. Y'all are killing me. I feel like a kid because I live at home soon, but as still as I get the fuck out. Mask post jeans? Sis, I don't know her. Paul, I can't wait for that for you. It's going to be so freeing for you. You're going to feel so much more like yourself. I hope you can do that as soon as possible. Yep, 2022, mind your own business. Literally, do your own thing. Your gas station still has them? Malibu, buy them now if you like them. I think they stopped making them. I haven't looked for one, honestly, Mock. I don't usually, like, if I'm getting ice cream, I usually just get, like, a tub of ice cream. Like, I'm not usually getting, like, like, packaged ice cream treats. I don't know why. It's just not what I typically, like, go towards just off the bat. But I always like them when I have them. So I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm fucking up. I need to get more. I need to get on the Choco Taco train before it's too late. A tub of ice cream? Yeah, like... Like a, like a Whoa, regular tub of ice that's cream. That's interesting, but I sure don't care. <laughs> Have you never called it a tub of ice cream? What do you call it? Carton of ice cream? Do I sound weird saying a tub? They need it to be a tea bell like they used to. You know, maybe they're going to do the whole Mexican pizza bit with it. Like they're going to be like, oh, Choco Tacos are gone. And then they're going to have Doja Cat make a song about it. And be like, oh, just kidding. It's back. <laughs> 
Can I even kill this bitch? I don't think so. It's a tub here too. Okay, that's what I've heard. I feel like whenever I come in here, I'm lightly- No, you're not trauma dumping anything. We're- we're supporting you. I don't see that as trauma dumping at all, because I don't think you're bringing anybody else down by doing it. Um, so I don't see it that way, then. Don't worry. Don't worry at all. You're not being annoying at all. I ran about my local Taco Bell out and how much I hate it. I feel like to Taco Bells are so hit or miss. I heard about Aspiring Warlock said that they got stuck at their Taco Bell in the drive-thru, like, blocked in for, like, almost two hours. And I'm like, yo, I would have a legit panic attack if I got stuck in a drive-thru, like, for two hours. I'd be done for. Like, no way. I'd be raging. I'd probably get out of my car and ask the people in front of me to get the fuck out of my way. I'd be like, you guys can pull around. I need to get the fuck out of here. I'm gonna freak out. <laughs> I'm that person. I'd be like, okay, leave. You don't have much of a sweet tooth, but I usually get the little pint size. Oh, I do love Ben and Jerry's. I don't know any of the flavors names very well though, but I know I like fish food. Don't don't laugh at me, but I know I really like the flavor of fish food. Can I get up here? Oh, nice, I can. This is kind of cool. Uh, use the time to listen to podcasts. Two hours being stuck in a drive-thru? No, no, couldn't. I freak out. I'd absolutely lose my shit. There's a Ben and Jerry's at the mall here. I can get it delivered. Yo, what? I went to the Ben and Jerry's like plant in Vermont when I was on work travel once. They have all these cute little gravestones for all the dead flavors. It was so freaking fun and cute. I loved it so much. I know it sounds weird, but like it was really good. It was like very cold out when I went though, so that was the only downside. <laughs> but it was really fun. Pierogi pal, what's up? How are you? Welcome in. I hope you're having a great day. Thanks for being here. We're talking about our favorite flavors of ice cream and lamenting the fact that um, Choco Tacos are not gonna be around for much longer, which is quite upsetting. And playing Super Mario Galaxy 2. I don't know if you've played Mario Galaxy 2 before, but this is my first playthrough. That happened to me at a coffee drive through last year. I was stuck for like 20 minutes and I was gonna throw up. Yeah! And drove off. Yeah, literally it's the worst feeling. I can't even imagine being like blocked in. I would freak out. Like having cars around me so I couldn't leave. Hell no. Hell no. Choco tacos are so good, Medicaid. I'm so sad that they're they're gonna be gone. Thank you for the shout out for Rogi Bell. I appreciate it. I've never played it. I've had it. I, you have it though. The second one, nice. I never owned Mario Galaxy two um, when I was growing up. I had Mario Galaxy one, but I never played the second one. So it's been really fun playing through it for the first time. Um, it's actually I think better than the first one. Um, so if you played the first one, I think. Oh my god. If you've played the first one, I think you'll like this one even better. That was a lot of freaking coins. Let's go. Remember how bad the Wendy's was in Jersey? I was stuck in line for 30 minutes every time. I don't even know why you kept going back. I would have never went back. Couldn't have done it. I would have been like, yeah, remember that one time you got stuck for 30 minutes? Couldn't. Would just simply never have Wendy's again. <laughs> I'm gonna go get some marble slab. Wait, marble slab? For what? Like to build a countertop? Favorite iced treats? Ooh, cold. Thanks for the cold. I only had one like 20 years ago. Yeah, it's been a long time since I've had one too. Damn it, I thought I could wall jump off that and I just face planted into it. Playing Breath of the Wild is erases all of your problems. I'm stuck in Breath of the Wild and I need to figure out where I need to go next. <laughs> I have lost. <laughs> I bought Metal uh, Metal Gear 2. Play oh, Mario Galaxy 2. Go. Played it right after Mario Galaxy 1. It was a mistake. Really? Oh, you did 